Well, it's uh, Friday morning about 9.44. I'm on my way to drop off some exchange knives at a restaurant. Then I got to swing a little further to the uh, west and meet uh, fireworks and pick up a uh, six inch coal for my Knox. She was in New Jersey this past weekend for that hunt that Joe DeMarco puts on and she picked up a six inch coal for me while, I, while she was up there. And I got them, I'm gonna use it for the button patch, but not till we get a little chill and some frost or something to get rid of the ticks and the chiggers. I think a couple of my buddies are going today to the button patch. Maybe I'll get some results. I know one guy has already been hunting it, but I don't know who he is. I just know it's a white Jeep. Anyway, uh, Denny and Alan are going to the beach in about 15 or 20 minutes. The low tide is not till around noon, so I'll still be okay. Because uh, now our buddy Alan, he's staying right at the schooner on 2nd Street, right at Rudy Inlet. So he's close to the action. All he's got to do is walk out of his room and he'll be there. Okay, I'll get back to you a little bit. I'm getting close. There's a parking garage on 9th Street. I'll see you at the beach in a few minutes. Well, there's a six inch coal for the Knox. You've seen plenty of coals, ain't no big deal. But I did get was a really nice Vanquish t shirt. Long sleeve. Isn't that cool? Vanquish. Okay, I'm putting my gear on. I'm ready to go. Three minutes. In my haste to leave this morning, I left my scoop home. I'm scoopless. You can't go to Nada without a scoop. So, I just have to be the cameraman today. I find these looters down here somewhere. I'll see what they're doing. Stand by. Well, that looks like Allen right there by his scoop. And I'm pretty sure I can see the Mumbles man about three blocks north. Stand by. We'll see how they do it. You can see Nada's nice today. There's no big waves. You could get out as far as you wanted to. You had the right stuff on it. Look at that. Man, you don't find it like this often. This is nice. I was doing okay till I got my scoop, got all my stuff out. I don't have no damn scoop. I left my scoop home. <laughs> no, I'm fine. <laughs> I'll just be the cameraman today. That's no fun. Yes, it is. Exercise is all I need. Well, hey. How you making out? We got a treasure yet? Denny found a big thing that had like a hinge on it. Yeah. Like a big piece of aluminum that had broken off. Uh-huh. And I think. I found a couple more pieces that went to it. Oh yeah, I got you. That's it. Huh. Nothing. It's pretty though. Ain't making big waves. It's really nice, ain't oh, it? Oh, it's gorgeous. This is absolutely low tide. Yeah, I know it. Tide is perfect. Yeah. All right, keep on going. I'll stay with you. I'll go. I see that looks like him down there, ain't it? Yeah. Right there where he is now, about 15 feet outside in that trough. It's like, I guarantee you that's a good spot. I don't know if he's going to get to it or not because he's over, over, overdressed kind of like. But just outside where he is, as far as you want to go to that way, it would be good. Let's go see what the Mumbles man's doing down here. Stand by. God, it's pretty. What a day to leave your scooter. Yeah, I know it. Water's nice. What a day to leave your scoop at home. There's one depositor there, two depositors there. That's all the depositors I see, except for one walking off the beach. Well, it's Friday, October, near the end of October. Okay, here, I found something already, look. Just walking on the beach. Sunglasses. 
They're kind of banged up though. Okay. I put them in my pouch. I got my pouch and my belt on. I figured I'd leave that on since my truck key was in my pouch. I'll get back to you. And here's another pair of sunglasses. Damn, I'm on a hot goose. Just laying in the sand. See what this is? Look like sunglasses here. It is. God. Unbelievable. Pair number four. What's up, Mama's man? Where's your heater at? My heater's in the damn truck. <laughs> but my scoop's at home. Oh. I got down here and got my deer on. I looked and said, wait a minute, I ain't got no damn scoop. Mm -hmm. I was in a hurry to get to the knife place this morning and left my scoop on. Yeah. How you making out? Nothing. Just a couple pairs of sunglasses. I picked up four pairs coming down here. Just up here. Look, right along in there. Yeah, I've seen a couple of pairs yeah. up there, down that way. You got some kind of hunk of metal. I got yeah. one penny. One penny, huh? One penny, that's it. I don't have a um, nickel, dime, quarter, nothing. Damn. It's, it's, it's nice though, ain't no big waves crashing no, in. No, it's, you know, I'm, I'm walking the, uh, I ran into Alan. Uh, he's, yeah. right, he's right down there. Yeah, I saw him first. Uh, and uh, I turned around there, I guess about this street, right after the pipe. Yeah. And then I uh, started coming up this way and I've been walking in the water. And there's, there's some stuff in there, you know. Yeah. More so than there is on the bank, anyway. Oh, I'll, I'll hang around and be the cameraman. It's not very. Uh... Well, you got the report. Nada is nada today. Very bleak. I see a guy up here fishing. Got two fishing poles in the water. I'll walk down and see how he's doing. Oh, that's two guys now. I see him. That, the other guy just walked up. And I'll check back as I hit the mumbles man going back. Hi, what a nice day. Pair number five. I got something right here. Uh-oh, I see pair number six right here. Hey, pair number seven, right here. That's only a half a pair. I don't know what this is. We'll take it with us, though. No wheels. Glove. A lot of stuff washed up right through here. If I was hunting, I'd have to move up to this area. I said they're not catching anything. Not even a bite today, he said. Because he's in Landonata. That's what happens to you sometimes in the Landonata. I think we're turning around now. It ain't much up this way. See how the Mumbles man's making up. Any change? There's a lot of stuff on, on the surface. You hit it, and then it washes away. Yeah. You know, it's uh, just floating around. I picked up two more pair of sunglasses right up there. Yeah, that... I got another pair myself. Yeah. I see them floating down there. Yeah. <laughs> I think there would be some chains up here. I know it. Chains at? 
If the glasses are floating around there, I'll do some. I know it, it's Look, funny. There's another pair. Oh yeah, I mean, <laughs> they're pretty nice ones right there, my old man. <laughs> they look pretty brand new. <laughs> Dale Earnhardt specials. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, all the glasses. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll check with you. All right, man. Take care. We'll walk along here, maybe we'll find some more washing up. I thought I saw a pair of sunglasses here, but I can't find them now. Uh, maybe, maybe I just kicked them with my foot. I don't see them, but I did see them. They're right here by my foot. No, nope, that ain't them. I'll get back to you. I don't think I've ever seen any clear glasses like this before. That's pair number six. I'm doing environmental cleanup today. I'm coming up back on Al and see how he's making that. He's going back in the morning, 6.30, I think they said leaving, going back to Kentucky. He got to leave early because they got a big race down here tomorrow. They're going to close a lot of the main streets. If you don't leave by a certain time, you can't leave until like 11 or 12. Same thing happened to the farmer's market. Have to be there early. If you ain't there early, you ain't going to get in. They got half the roads, almost two thirds of the roads closed. Stand by. That's a hood on a car. Yeah, that's Mike, exactly why what it is. Why don't you take my detector? Oh man, I'm the cameraman like today. <laughs> I found six pair of sunglasses going down the beach to see the mumbles, man. Did you really? Washed up on the beach. He got a couple pairs there. Just washing up? Yeah. You had any luck since I saw you last? No. That car part was it. Yeah. Pull tabs. Uh, well. That is it. What is that? I don't know. What it's a ring. Is? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yep. It's kind of bad in Nada today, isn't it? It's called crap. Miss Craft is right. Okay. All right, buddy. I'm going to head on. I doubt you can see it, but that's the dredge working at the root of the inlet to get the sand out. And they got the pump. You can't see the pump either, but the pump's not pumping right now, but it was pumping. That big pipe you see, if you can see it sticking up right there, just about straight ahead. And that's an Army Corps of Engineers dredge. I don't know what that rig outside is. It looks like a barge with a crane on it. Okay, I'm getting ready to head off. I'll get back to you when I get back to the rancho. Some big fish sticking up here. Nice street. Beach entrance. Blue, too. I might as well do my roundup right here at the top of their parking garage. That's it. Sunglass, environmental cleanup. No scoop required. Second floor. Well, there it sits. Right where I left it yesterday, right next to the alarm wall. <laughs> Damn, I can't believe it. And that's not the first time, but it's been the first time in a long time. There's some eagles up there, look at them. Waiting to get to the bird seed in the back. It got so bad one time, I used to have to carry two scoops all the time. 
But today, I didn't carry any scoops.